Well, hi everybody. This is GP. I'm back with another presence tapping video. This one's going to be a little bit different. All of my presence tappings are, they're kind of a combination of tapping, meridian tapping, and guided meditation. And um, you don't say anything. You don't need to repeat what I say. If this is the first time you've done one of my presence tapping, the rules are different. You just um, listen. You just follow my lead, but you don't have to repeat what I say. This is tapping without words. Although I will be using words to help direct the energy to uh, towards a resolution of whatever happens to be troubling you at the time. This one's going to be a little bit different. You'll notice by the title it's called Just Be, which means we're not going to try to process anything. We're going to do something we almost never do, at least rarely do. And unless you've done one of my guided meditations, you've almost certainly never done this. And that is we're simply going to give ourselves permission to let go of everything in our life and just be present with ourselves. Just be with yourself. Just be. Being isn't a doing. <laughs> and you go, well, how do I do that? Well, I'm going to guide you to get there. But it's not really what you do. It's what you don't do. It's all the things that you don't do. So just like I always do with presence tapping, we start by taking a couple of deep breaths. And uh, I want you to breathe in through your nose and then out through your mouth. You can even make a sound if you like, like. But make the exhale longer than the inhale. That little thing there uh, actually has quite a profound physiological effect on all of us. It's very natural. So as you're taking those breaths, I want you to uh, start closing your eyes and just start relaxing into your body. Now as we go into this, as uh, different as this is from other times that I've done it, I'm going to take my image off the screen and just put a nice image up there for you because you're going to have your eyes closed the whole time, so it's not important that you see anything in particular. I'm also going to add a little bit of music, very softly in the background for you, a little bit of meditation music to kind of help set the atmosphere as we dive into this practice of just being. So as you're just breathing, your eyes are closed. You're, uh, if you haven't started yet, you can start tapping through the points. In any order that you like, in any form that you like. There's no particular rule to this. Just, just any way you like to do it so that the tapping is going on. It need not be coordinated with what I said. In fact, for sure won't be. And now we're just starting by feeling the body, feeling the effect that uh, this body-centered modality of tapping has on the nervous system. So I just want you to set an intention now. For the next few minutes or so, you're going to give yourself permission to just be with yourself. Now that simply means you're going to consciously choose to not engage with all of the things you normally engage with. 
So during your day you have uh, responsibilities and commitments. You have relationships, maybe family. You have your job or your business, your practice. Maybe there's organizations that you belong to and really believe in, church, or, um, temple or ashram. Just for now, we want to set all of those responsibilities aside. For the next few moments, they are completely outside. It's like you've just set them aside for a while. We're not diminishing them, we're not making them unimportant, they are. But for right now, we're just going to make you more important for just a while. Now this may feel a bit difficult to do if you've never done this before. We're so used to our day flowing along with this momentum of one thing after another. Even a lot of um, unintentional distractions being bombarded by many sides. You may have never actually decided consciously to withdraw from all of it. Withdraw your attention back into just you. Notice how your body feels, the sensations that are uh, moving through it. Notice how your emotions are going. Now normally, we have sensations and emotions and thoughts and things would come up. Maybe things from the past, a memory or something re recent or very, very distant may come up. There will be a reaction to it in the body and in the emotions. Should that happen, just notice it. It's not unimportant. But just choose consciously to not engage with it. You'll notice that there is a pattern that happens, a very natural occurrence, where there could be a sensation you feel in your body. And reflexively, almost immediately, our minds will kick in with a judgment, a comparison, a like or a dislike, a preference for something else. A whole cascade of thoughts follows forming a story. Normally, we get very involved in that story. We find ourselves following that story. but. You have a wonderful and amazing power. And that's the power to not follow the story, but bring your attention back to the simple experience of the sensation in your body, whatever it is that happened to arise. Just that. No story, no mind, no cascade of thoughts just the direct experience of yourself. Now for many that is difficult, it's new. But like anything new that you've never done before, riding a bike, or playing an instrument, or even learning how to talk, it takes a while to really get the hang of it. But it starts with that intention to just try. In this just be tapping meditation, you can't fail. Just the intention is enough. 
just the attempt is enough. Now, even in the attempt that you're making, even if it feels like you're not getting anywhere with this at all, maybe even I don't even know why I'm doing this, just notice those thoughts. Bring the attention back and just notice what's happening in your body. Your body, unlike our conscious mind, is always aware of everything. It's taking everything in. So even the tiniest adjustment to uh, the way you normally do things, a tiny step away from just the momentum of the repetitive pattern is sensed acknowledged and responded to on a level that we're not even conscious of and don't need to be. Your body, the nervous system, it knows what it's doing and it doesn't miss a thing. So even the tiniest intention has a profound effect. So you find yourself getting distracted, getting pulled into the um, stream of a story about something that's happening, some event, oftentimes a memory, maybe even a thought like, well, this is really good. I wonder what I'm going to do afterwards or gee, this was nice, maybe I'll do this again, or anything that refers to the future, even the immediate future, to say, ah, I choose to let go of that. I'm not going to engage with it right now. Again, this is not a diminishment. We're not trying to suppress it. We're not trying to make it go away just giving ourselves permission to step out of the normal, unconscious flow of our day and into this little vacation that we're giving ourselves. And what a gift. What a gift you're giving yourself. Now your mind our habitual way of thinking, especially because this is a tapping video, may be thinking, well, how is this going to solve my issue? I'm going to invite you to also set aside all your issues, all the things in your life that really need your loving attention, that need tapping. For right now, those two are being just set to the side. Nothing wrong with them. We'll come back to them later. But maybe, just maybe, with this level of inner attention, some of those issues will dissolve all on their own. Sometimes things don't need a lot of processing, just a little bit of inner open space. Space for you. And in this space you're giving yourself, the nervous system, the energy system, detecting that, can begin to flow down more healthy, open channels. All it needs is the space. But now that's not what we're, why we're here. We're not to here to 
fix or change anything. We're just here to be with ourselves. You are here to be with you. This is what it means to just be. Just be present. Just be yourself. So I'm going to ask you to do now is to let go of the tapping, but keep your eyes closed and just sit with your body for a little bit. Now I'm going to stop talking and I'm going to let the music continue for a minute or two and then fade out. But don't be in a hurry. You don't have to rush away as it fades out. You can stay here as long as you want and uh, just enjoy yourself. Just be. <laughs> 